what is happening. Welcome back. It's been a long time, but we are here in downtown Nashville. We are going to dine, we're going to eat, we're going to drink, we're going to check out this town and see what it has to offer. I've been hearing amazing things about Nashville, and we're here to do it all. perfectly cooked. They suggested medium rare and I was kind of like, mm, I like it medium, but that's good. Okay, we gotta talk about these mashed potatoes now because they're next level. We're like, is it a lot of butter? I think they put heavy cream in there. There's something in there that is just like, to get access to a beautiful home here on West Main Street. This is 1003 West Main. We are surrounded by incredibly gorgeous historic homes. Most of the homes on the street are from the late 1800s. The listing price is 2.695. And I couldn't come into town, into Tennessee, and not see what they have for real estate here because that is also another thing that I do. So I'm gonna take a look inside. I just did a quick tour and I mean first of all these floors like come on ridiculous just beautiful and the high ceilings in here so much open space and one really cool feature that I see in this house is they have Lighting, we've got an eating kitchen, that leaves absolute patio. So 2.695 gets you a lot in Tennessee. Uh, wouldn't get you that far in New York City, but here you're getting a house, a yard, right in the center of town and just incredible renovations. So I really like this house. <laughs> in downtown Franklin, Tennessee, which is about 25 miles south of downtown Nashville. It's a quaint, cute little town, and we are at the famous Biscuit Love. And when I say it lives up to the hype, it totally does. I mean, just mind-blowing, amazing. If you're in Nashville, you should head on down to Franklin and check out Biscuit Love. It was amazing. is ready. <laughs> Heard from multiple sources that Peg Leg Porker is the best barbecue in Nashville. So we're here, we're gonna see if that's the truth. We're gonna get some ribs, some sausage, and check it out. Comes out with dry rub on it, and then you put on your own sauce. You've got the mild here, we put a little mild and a little hot, so it's spicy. And, uh, all right, let's see.
feel you were amazing. You did not disappoint. I was blown away by the incredible food here, the friendliness of the people. So we're on our way back. Stay tuned for our next episode. There's going to be more travel, more fun, way more food.